Where'd he get a candy bar? Been in his pocket the whole time? No way that wouldn't be melted. <laughs> I've been walking through the woods the whole last two days. Howdy, folks. Welcome on back to you, me, and the TV. And it's time to head back to the island. Yep. We have to go back. <sighs> yep. Lost season four. What's going on? Do you remember where we left off last week? It was like a big flash forward episode last week, I feel like. Yeah. I'm hopeful we figure out how they get off the island, how they decide who gets off the island. Yeah. Because clearly there's a conspiracy about people staying behind. Yeah. Only six getting off, and then the other one, like, what the hell happens to the other ones? Mm hmm. And Jack lost his appendix. That's right. That's right. And uh, Alex died. Yeah. Yep. But then Ben unleashed the smoke monster. Mm-hmm. In the, like some underground ruins or something. Yeah. So what's next? Are we gonna figure out? Are we gonna find out? Maybe the how they get off the island soon. Let's hope. Should we f jump in and find out? For sure. Let's do it. But first, like, comment, subscribe. Come hang out with us. And check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to our videos, full-length commentaries, access to polls to help us pick what we watch next. Link's down below. Check it out. We also got social media, so if you like Twitter, 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 if you like Twitter or Instagram, <laughs> Twitter or Instagram, you can check us out at You Me The Movies. Mm -hmm. Let's watch more Lost, season four. Do it. All day. Are we gonna get there soon? How long? It's a magical cabin, you guys. What? what do you mean you've been following him? I'm not even in front. I have no idea where the cabin is. Hugo's the last one that saw it. Oh, this is just awesome. What do you think we should do, John? We're making camp. <laughs> All right, get him on the litter. No. Careful. Remember the last time we saw the doctor? Yeah, he was dead on shore. Is that the same doctor? Time travel. Don't understand it. You tell me exactly how many people are on that island, where every single one of them is. Linus, you knew who I was, you knew my name. You knew everything about me. I'm not the one who gave you up. Then who did? Ouchie. Do you know who I am? A jerk? Wait! Martin, no! <laughs> Martin, we need him. He's the only one who can fix the engines. The universe won't let him get shot. I guess the universe will let him get his ass kicked, though. Yeah, you can feel pain, you just can't die. <laughs> it's Ben's dad. Yeah? No. Oh. That was the guy that helped Ben's dad get a job. Hmm. Last time we saw him, he was dead on a bench, though, when Dharma got killed. Right. He's invisible, it's fine. I mean, he's, like, he's a ghost, it's okay. No, I mean, sometimes you need a break from the DI, you know? Is your name Jacob, by chance? I'm not making any sense, am I? That's probably because I've been dead for 12 years. You gotta find me, John. You gotta find me. And when you do, you'll find him. Oh, so you're not Jacob. You go. Malamar. 
Wake up, Hugo. <laughs> I love a Malamar. Also, you cannot find them around here at all. Like, yeah. they just don't exist around here. I don't, like, do they even make Malamars anymore? Oh, yeah. I used to have dreams. Cool. Good story. Is that the father? I I don't know who that is. I knew that guy didn't age at all. <laughs> What's Richard doing there when Locke's just a baby? <laughs> I don't know. He's time traveling jackasses. <laughs> you can see the cabin. And that makes you special. Well, I have a theory as to why we're the only ones who can see it. I'd love to hear it. I think we can see it because we're the craziest. <laughs> You're probably right. Pit stop? Where? Gotta dig up Horace. And then one day, they're all gone. They just disappear. You wanna know where we're going? To that mass grave that you got thrown into. <laughs> Whoa. Watch out. Ben's behind you. He might just push you in. It's all yours. Now that is a perfectly sized piano. Yeah, we're seeing a lot of those in the last time. I run a school for kids who are extremely special. He's like Professor X then, huh? Maybe. <laughs> Oh, a smoke monster even at that age, huh? No, no, John. Which of these things belong to you already? In the future. You sure the knife belongs to you, John? You sure about that? Oh, it doesn't. How did he do? I'm afraid uh, John isn't quite ready for our school. I'm sorry I've wasted your time. What was the third item he was looking for? A comic book. Hugo, I was standing right where you are now when I pulled the trigger. <laughs> Is that why you killed all these people, too? I didn't kill them. Hmm. Yeah, you did. You found what you were looking for? Yes, Hugo, I believe I did. I'm still sure. I'm still pretty sure it just moves, you know, yeah. moves around. That was the Morse code coming in saying the doctor's dead. What? Meet me behind the container in 10 minutes. The boat will be in the water. I forced you to come with us at gunpoint, and I'm sorry, Hugo, but I was led to believe that we needed you to find this place. Oh, I get it. Now you got your magic map, you don't, you don't need me anymore. I don't want to put you in harm's way against your will. You think walking through the jungle at night by myself is going to be any <laughs> What? He actually thinks staying was his idea. Not bad, John. Not bad at all. <laughs> I'm not you. You're certainly not. That's creepy. Does that mean Locke actually wanted him to go? I got a call from Portland recently. There's a company up there doing some very exciting things in chemistry and new technologies. They're called Mitalos Laboratories. He's very interested in finding young, bright minds to enter in these new fields of science. They want you to go to their camp this summer. Don't you understand that things like science camp are the reason why I get stuffed into lockers? John, Destiny right. calling, and he says, screw you. What are they putting on him? Don't know. Stay on a heading of exactly 305. Faraday says that's the only safe way to and from the boat. You yeah, you'll be back on the island in like 84 days or something. Right. <laughs> it should be about 200 yards this way. But it's nighttime on the island. Yeah, it's like a different day. We, I mean. <laughs> Guys? Cabin. 
Who's going to be in there? A ghost, a nobody, I don't know. Horace. Excuse me? I'm just saying, don't give up. Anything's possible. Where else have we seen him? Can't remember. He's the one uh, asking the Oceanic Six if there's other survivors. You should. I had one happen to me. She's going to push him down those stairs. When you and me run into each other again, you'll owe me one. See Jacob? Get your ass in the cockpit and fire up the chopper, Frank. I'm not taking you. I'll kill you, Frank. Yeah, while you do that, you'll never get back. <laughs> Good thinking. <laughs> I don't think you want to do that, Captain. What's that on his arm? What's that on his arm? Oh, damn. What'll it be, Frank? We're flying. Kimi's a bad dude. I think he takes it down. Pilot, you think he's gonna crash it? I don't know. My instinct says that's what he should do, <laughs> but yeah. Nice, good catch. I think they want us to follow him, or not. Or they want you to avoid that. That's them. the message. <laughs> Don't know. All right. Let's do this. I'm not going in there with you. What? Yeah. My time is over. It's yours now. Yeah. I'm cool with you going in alone too. <laughs> Good luck, buddy. Good luck, John. <laughs> it's going through Ben's mind. Is he being truthful? You never know with that guy. He's almost never truthful. The whole place is about to shake. Is that Jack's dad? <laughs> Are you Jacob? No. But I can speak on his behalf. It is Jack's dad. I'm Christian. Why are you sitting in the shadows, Christian? You know why I'm here? Yeah, sure. Do you? No, I don't know why you're there either. Claire? Hi, John. What are you doing here? Don't worry, I'm fine. I'm with him. She's dead. The people from the boat are already on their way back. And once they get here, all of these questions won't matter one bit. So why don't you ask the one question that does matter? How do I save the island? I'm a little annoyed that dead Claire's hanging out with her dad and not Charlie. You think Claire's dead? Yeah. Where'd he get a candy bar? Hurley's always got candy bar in his Is pocket. Snickers? Probably a Malamar. I love Snickers. Or Apollo bar from the Dharma. Hmm. In his pocket the whole time? No way that wouldn't be melted. <laughs> He's cold blooded. I've been walking through the woods the whole last two days. Did he tell you what we're supposed to do? I did. Well? He wants us to move the island. <laughs> I mean, all right. What does that mean? With faith, all things are possible. You know? <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, Locke is a man of faith. Yeah. All right. So what's going on? I don't know. So do you like that little uh, 
Hurley and Ben interaction there. Hurley, Her- Hurley, Hurley sharing a little candy bar with Ben, despite all the animosity. Whatever. Does that mean? Hurley's a nice guy. Yeah. Even Hurley can forgive? No, but even Hurley feels bad eating in front of somebody who's probably hungry. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you think Claire is dead and just hanging out with ghost Claire's hanging out with ghost, her ghost dad? I think so. Yeah. Is that really Christian Shepherd though? Uh, I don't know. It's yeah. a ghost. I don't know. Yeah. So what do you think the uh, phone was dropped for? They never did find his body. Yeah. Remember the casket was empty. I think somebody took his body and is using it as their shell. I don't understand this show at all. <laughs> <laughs> or is the body never put on the flame? Remember Jack's argument with the... Yeah. Or the island healed his dead dad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's another possibility. Huh? There's so many things. Yeah, so what do you think the phone was dropped for? Do you think it was... He's trying to... Say, here, follow me to the get to the helicopter and let's get out of here? Or, or? I don't know. I don't know if it was follow me or here's where we are, stay the hell away. He could have written a little note or something. Yeah. Hmm. Well, we're about to start the first episode of the three-part finale to season four. Can't wait. So um, let's do we that. We won't get through all the finale tonight, just the first part. So That's ready to funny. watch more Lost? Yeah. Let's watch some more Lost season four. We're coming in for a landing. It's a military facility just west of Honolulu. It's completely private. They're referring to you as the Oceanic Six. That's not the best branding as far as we're concerned, but it's catchy. We'll see you on the ground. Turnip head does count as a six. Yeah, I guess so. We all know the story. If we get any questions that we don't want to answer, or that we can't answer, let's just keep our mouths shut. It's okay, they'll, they'll think that we're in shock. We are in shock, Jack. <laughs> Hurley's dad's still with his mom. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Kate's got nobody. Either just turn up head or Saeed. The orchid. Get the guns and get some water, okay? okay? You can't possibly be serious. <laughs> you just. <laughs> because I promised those people that I would get them off this island. Don't bleed to death, Jack. We have to get off this island <laughs> right now. Oh, what does Daniel Faraday know? Do we have like a nuclear bomb sort of situation at the orchid? You're bleeding. No, I'm not bleeding. I'm separating it. Discharge. My body's just fighting an infection around my stitches. You know when most people are lying and they can't look you in the eye? <laughs> You do the exact opposite. <laughs> Where are you talking to up there, Genghis? Where's Claire? We lost her. You what? Legitimately, they lost her. Look. I put Saeed and Desmond on that chopper. It was my call. My responsibility. You know, I'll head back to the beach. That son of a bitch is stubborn. Hold up. You don't get to die alone. <laughs> Do you like Sawyer now? I don't dislike him anymore. Yeah. Uh, can you tell us what it was like when the plane hit the ocean? Uh, how you survived? Um, nope. We were in the water for over a day before the current took us in. By then, there was only eight of us left. One of them, his name is Boone Carlisle. Libby, she didn't make it through the first week. Charlie Pace, he, he drowned a few weeks before we were able to leave. Your son, uh, Aaron, how old is he now? He's just a little over five weeks. 
So that would have made you about six months pregnant when the U.S. Marshal Service apprehended you in Australia for an outstanding murder warrant. Is that correct? Uh, I'm sure, if you say so. <laughs> Is it possible there are any other survivors from the crash yet to be discovered? No, absolutely not. But why? Not yet. She's pretty. Mm -hmm. Time to shoot your shot, Saeed. <laughs> well, he does. He marries her. So when is someone going to tell me where we're going? We're going to a place called the Orchid, Hugo. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. And why are we going to a greenhouse, exactly? You heard John, we're going to move the island. Right. And how are we going to do that? Very carefully. Well, if you could move the island whenever you wanted... For the Ouija board? <laughs> there it is. You're at the greenhouse. <laughs> Candy bar. Candy bar. <laughs> Malamars. Oh, crackers. Hurley <laughs> just starts munching on them. You know, those are 15 years old. When you when you're hungry, you're hungry, you know. Communicating. Communicating with who? Who do you think? All right now we can go. Wait, what was that? What did you tell them? <laughs> None of your business, John. Who is he talking to? Those people. Aaron's like, a lot of different people are holding me today. This is weird. <laughs> She's like, nice. <laughs> Ooh, girl. Mm, he did die. She got paid a lot of money then. Mom? Uh oh. Poor Hugo. <laughs> Grabs the Jesus. <laughs> I don't know, I thought there might be a prowler or something. Jesus Christ is not a weapon. <laughs> An island theme party. Real <laughs> nice. Way to read the room, Mom. Happy birthday, Hugo. Wow, you guys are here. <laughs> Interesting choice of theme. Yeah, Mom. Marie doesn't get it, dude. <laughs> Check it out. It's a nice car. Oh, four, eight, fifteen, sixteen, twenty-three, forty-two. Did you do this? Couldn't have driven it one more mile, one more tenth of a mile, even. Hugo, where you going? Come on, Hugo. Just running down the street, running away <laughs> as fast as possible. May I have the binoculars, please? You might want to get down lower to the ground. And why might we want to do that? Because we're at the orchid. Okay, the first one's there. The man who's trying to capture me and kill all the rest of you knows about this place and knows that what we need is inside. I thought you said you had no idea why he was trying to find the island. I wasn't being entirely truthful. Oh, shocker. When are you ever entirely truthful? Never. Not once ever. <laughs> They're already here. Yikes. 
But make sure you, you stay in a bearing of 305. It's going to be exactly 305. We've got some kind of RF interference with the pedometer. I can't see the reef, mate. But something on this boat is broadcasting. If we don't turn it off, I'm not going any closer than five miles off the coast. Who's broadcasting something? I don't know, but I'm feeling very sick about this whole situation. Well, I'm also a little wondering why it's going to take two more seasons to wrap this up when I feel like they could wrap it up right now. Huh? So why don't you do me a favor and get in that back compartment. There's a toolbox. See if you can find something to get me out of these things. You heard me, man. Well, all right. Could I get you boys a nice cold glass of lemonade while I'm back there? <laughs> you said the hit squad's going to grab Ben Linus. Well, I don't see what's going to stop them. What are they going to do with the people that are with them? Nothing good. Hugo's with Ben. Oh, no. Son of a bitch. <laughs> he didn't come to see me. I was still in the hospital. Claire's mom? He came to see his daughter. My daughter. If you don't believe me, check his phone records. Would you like to know the strangest thing about all this, Mr. Shepherd? Oh, sh My daughter was on your plane too. She was one of the ones who died. Her name was Claire. <laughs> keep it cool, keep it cool, keep it cool. I'm sorry for your loss. That means Aaron's your nephew, dude. <laughs> Uncle Jack. Your son is beautiful. It's her grandson. Hmm. Did Kate hear all that? I don't think so. Hey, Michael! I need you! No! Oh my god. Oh! We ain't got some help. No. He's like, get the out of here right now. <laughs> All right, let's, let's just stop. Let's relax. Stop. Relax, put the guns down. I said stop right there. Please just drop your guns. Richard, you ageless wonder. I said drop your guns. You both got bigger fish to fry here. Listen to me very carefully, John, because I'm not going to have time to repeat this. You're going to go into that greenhouse through that hole there and left. Go about 20 paces until you see a patch of anthuriums on your left. They're in an alcove. I already lost it. I'm sorry, Ben, but maybe I missed the part where you explain what I'm supposed to do about the armed men inside. I'm going to take care of them. And how the hell are you going to do that? How many times do I have to tell you, John? I always have a plan. <laughs> You just never share it with anyone, ever. My name is Benjamin Linus. I believe you're looking for me. Ouch. Is that part of his plan? Must have been. Well. Yeah. Got a bunch of pieces moving all over the place. What do you think Richard's doing with Kate and so Saeed? I have no idea. But they all get out of there at some point, or yeah. the two of them get out of there at some point. Then Jack and Sawyer are heading towards the orchid. Mm-hmm. To get Hurley. And the boat is covered in C4. What's that all about? I don't know. I find it so interesting that the six that make it out are all in super different positions that are very different dangerous like they should all die right like <laughs> given this how they get off the island in. all together yeah exactly how do they manage to all get off the island when they're all basically in just different places entirely uh, with the exception of kate and saeed but so we got two episodes left in season four what's ben's plan and how is this gonna end i don't know that ben ever has a plan uh -huh. or he always has a plan but never shares it so it's like he's i have no idea what's happening <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how it's going to end. I don't know. I, I mean, apart from they get off, those six get off the island, but I feel like the rest are going to die. Yeah. So we found out the three survivors from the plane that they said made it to the island, but didn't 
Yeah, Boone, interesting that they Libby. chose Boone, Libby, and Charlie. Yeah. Why not any of the others? Well, that they were, were all actually... already dead, though, so. Yeah, I guess. So maybe that has something to do with it. They figured they buried Boone and Libby so they'd never find their... I don't, I don't know. I don't yeah. know. Interesting choices. Apart from Saeed was really attached to... No. Boone wasn't really attached to anybody. Like, yeah, why did they pick him? Off, but, yeah. Right. Yeah. Like, it makes sense, Charlie, because he was really attached to... No, but I don't know. <laughs> this show. Every time with this show. I guess we'll see. Man. And Aaron was part of the Oceanic Six. True. Yeah. A lot of people were wondering if he counted because he wasn't on the manifest because right, right. he was in a belly. But... He did. What should people comment on? I don't know. Well, I mean, what do you even comment on in this show? Why do you think they chose Boone, Libby, and Charlie yeah. as the three of the eight that survived the plane crash but didn't make it? Eh? Right. It's part of their story. Let us know what you think about that in the comments below. Yeah, like, comment, subscribe also. Mm. Thanks for hanging out. Yeah, and check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to our videos, full-length commentaries, or access to polls to help us pick what we watch next. Links down below. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.